Hey, this is Erin, and welcome back to another edition of acuityscheduling.com. Well, actually, just acuity scheduling. But anyway, here's another feature. This is called the notifications, and you can actually set all your notifications to be completely personalized per appointment type which I actually love. So per calendar, per appointment type, you can completely make everything um, exactly how you want it to be. So if you have some appointments that you need um, people to know some things for and then other appointments that they don't need to know that for or they get different kind of reminders, um, it's super easy to get everything done. So anyway, all you do is you pull down where it says new appointment type, um, you pull down and it gives you all the different kinds of appointments that you have available. So let's say I want to do something called a parent consultation, a custom email. Okay, so it says your appointment for blah on blah time during blah has been successfully scheduled. Great, that's what I have it say. Now I think I have them say something different for like when it's students. Um, no, maybe not. Uh, during that has been successfully scheduled. Let me see if I actually did anything different for any of these. No, those ones are all the same. So, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But you see, so if you're doing a startup session right here, it says, please install VC. So that means on some of them, like the CogMed startup, if it's a startup session, I make sure to have this link in here. Whereas if it's just an ongoing and they've already done their startup session, they don't need to know this message every single time. Um, I think I've mentioned this before, but one of my favorite things is being able to do text message reminders. So right here, boom, the text message, your appointment reminder right there. You can change it and make it anything you want and it'll send it 24 hours ahead of time or um, you can change that and make it any, but I like doing the 24 hours ahead just so they know. And then you can do default for all appointments or whatever you want. So pick your appointment type and then there's my reminder and this one has different information than maybe um, my confirmation email because I want to make sure that they get all their stuff. One that I think is kind of cool, although I haven't had anybody actually like take me up on the offer of talking to me about it, but is the follow-up. So as soon as your appointment's over, it sends up a follow-up e email and I just have mine say, thanks for working with us. Were there any questions? Were there any concerns? If not, then let us know. Go in, and I did a little plug, go to my Facebook page and then you, that'll help you so you can find your next appointment. So I think they're all the same. Yep, it just lets you know that you can go and do that. So anyway, um, rescheduling, there's an appointment. But what I really like too is that it sends me text message reminders when anybody makes the appointment. You can turn that feature off, but I like having shown up on my phone so I know immediately when someone's made a change to their schedule so that I'm not like worried I missed an email or something. So anyway, notifications. Awesome. Bye-bye. Click the link below to try Acuity scheduling software for free.